Here, kiddo. Oh no. Ingrath, I am so sorry. For what? I made a mistake. I got sloppy. And I failed. Oh. Oh, Z, no. No, you've done no such thing. But I did! Tell me what happened. What makes you think that? I left Inigo in Kindsgrove because I thought Mercer wouldn't... Well, I thought he'd be mean if I brought someone else, it's because I thought he was supposed to be a stealth mission. Sneaky, sneaky, no? So I left him behind, and I should have seen it coming. Z, that's not being sloppy. That's normal. But you can't be normal in this kind of work, though. You have to be the best all the time, or else, or else you get killed. Zamari, <laughs> it's okay. You don't have to be the best. You just have to be better than the other person? No. No. I'm horrible at this. No, you have to be better than your own mistakes. Does that make sense? No. Not really. Well, here. Look at it this way. You expected Carlia to confront you at some point, right? Yes. But you also expected Mercer to have your back. A reasonable assumption given that he leads the Thieves' Guild and you're part of that family now. This is true. But I could have brought Inigo just in case and- Z, it's okay. Based on the information you had, you did the best that you could. And I need to do better so I don't almost die next time. Don't say that. The fact that you're looking back on this at all means you're willing to learn from it. You're good enough already, Z. But I... You are. Don't argue with me. I trained enough kids back in Cyrodiil to know that. I've never been more proud of anyone than I am of you. Did you talk to Carlia? Yeah, she gave me a journal and told me to go find Gallus's friend up in Winterhold. And she told me what happened in there. Mercer... He turned on us. Yes, he did. And Carlia saved your life, more or less. She put you out of action for a few days, but... Oh no... Inigo must be worried about me. But we have to get to Winterhold then. Um, we. Um, not. right now, Z. Just. You just woke up and I'm still worried about you. Winterhold is just up the way, right? I'll be fine. And they have restorationists there. No, I. Z. I need to tell you something. I made a mistake, too, a while ago. It's time you heard about it. Oh, okay. What is this about, exactly? Well, you remember the Brazen Clan, right? Of course. Oh, is this about Einar? I know you two had a thing- Um, no, I- well, you weren't supposed to know about that either, but apparently neither of us kept that very well under wraps. It was rather obvious, you know. You're too damn observant, you know that? Hmm, <laughs> speedy Kajit. So what else wasn't I supposed to know about? Speedy Kajit indeed. Is this about the Cutters, or... Ingra? 
Yes. Partially. I... I know you saw the cave after... After I was done with them. Oh. Oh no. I, I don't think I want to talk about this anymore. It's not what you think. I don't blame you for being gone. I was too. You were on a mission and I was... asking for help. But I was too late, and... You didn't kill them, did you? Cat and Beast and Earthhag? No. No, I didn't. But I did... I did mangle the cutters. They... Ingrath? Ingrath, what did you do? What happened? Why do you sound so angry? I... I screwed up, Z. I screwed up and I've been trying to keep it from you ever since, but... You deserve to know, especially after what Mercer did to you. I do not like where this is going. Ingrath! Your eye! Yeah. Yeah, I'm a... I'm sorry. I thought getting stronger... I was scared, Z. I was scared and I didn't know what else to do, so... I thought it would take a monster to kill those monsters. I wish I could say I regret it, but the only thing I regret was trying to stay away from you because of it. I didn't want you to know. Ingrath. I was trying to protect you by keeping you away from me, and instead you ended up getting shot by Inigo and stabbed by... There's no way to apologize for that. I know you saw me, back in the cave, that, that was me, and I'm sorry if I scared you, I'm sorry if I'm currently scaring you, I- So we can't leave right now because it's the middle of the day, huh? What? Oh come on, it's no big deal. You think a little bit of glowy weirdness is going to scare me? After what just happened? <laughs> All right. Here's what we'll do then. Wait for nightfall, then go to Winterhold. And then we'll find Inigo. Okay. Okay. Um actually, I can summon him now. So we won't have to run all the way back to Kynesgrove. I'm sure he's worried about me. You can... summon Inigo? Mm-hmm. A lot has happened. So, we met this man named Langley up in the Pale, and oh my gods, what a jerk, but he was having these visions of Inigo and kept giving him headaches because of the spell that he was trying to do, and... Hey, uh, Cayman. It appears to be nighttime out. Can we go now? Yeah, give me one second. I need to make myself look like I'm not a vampire again. That is a pretty nifty spell, if you don't mind my saying so. Thanks. Friend taught it to me. Okay, are you ready? Yep. Boy, you really weren't kidding. Winterhold is right over there. Yes, and with any luck, uh, the man we need to speak to is there. Who were we? Oh. You vanished. I forgot something. Okay. Who are we speaking to? Well... I oh, I should probably put out the fire, huh? Yes. Um, there we go. <laughs> okay. 
Now we can go. <laughs> oh. This one cannot run very fast right now. Ooh, she definitely feels like she got stabbed by a fray. Uh, right, who are we speaking to? The Archmage, if we're lucky. Okay. And I have someone else that I need to talk to as well. But... With any luck, he'll be able to point us in the right direction. The Archmage, I mean. Gotcha. Oh, hey, look! It is Azura! <laughs> she was watching over me while I was... healing. I suppose she was, wasn't she? Thanks, Azura. <laughs> you are not the most reverent of people, are you? Not to Azura. Okay, this one really wishes she could summon Inigo right about now, but... I also don't think it's necessarily a good idea. Why not? Well... He doesn't know about you. Actually... Wait, do you and Ingra... Oh, Inigo. You both start with I. Yeah, sorry. I suppose we do. But we've met. It probably isn't a good idea to summon him anyway. Oh boy. You two have history? No, I just saw him in the inn back in Riften. Oh... I told him to take care of you. Uh-oh. So if I were to summon him, he would think that you were mad at him? For, um, not taking care of me? Correct. I wouldn't be, but... Storm cloaks. Hmm. You know, with your spells and such, you could probably be a mage. At the college? Could you really see me up there? Nope! That's what I thought. Ah! This one feels amazing! Oh, hey look! Joan and Jode! Just being... Joan and Jode. You're getting distracted. What were you going to say? I was going to say I'm very happy because it has been a while since we went out and did things. Um... Sorry. Uh, we probably shouldn't talk about that, huh? Yeah... Okay. <laughs> oh! I just saw it. Oh! Shining star! Shooting star! Something! Or maybe it was snow, I'm not sure. You haven't changed at all, I see. Nope. Well, maybe a little bit. I'm less likely to go charging into things now than I was. Ooh! To the inn for a drink, of course. Where else could I even go in this god's forsaken town? And what? You think that'll solve all your problems? Just ignore them, Z. I'm ignoring. I wanted to see that girl with the cool armor, though. I... she's kind of... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how people can wear such things in this weather. Well, she's probably a Nord. She's got the blood for it. Good point. Okay. Um... Hello? Cross the bridge at your own peril. Ah, uh, okay. The way is dangerous, and the gate will not open. You shall not gain entry. Uh... Okay. Why are you out here? I am here to assist those seeking the wisdom of the college. And if, in the process, my presence helps to deter those who might seek to do harm, so be it. The more important question is, why are you here? 
Oh, well, you see, uh, I've been sent to talk to somebody about things. We need a translator and have, uh, we need to speak to the Archmage if that's okay. We can wait here if you want to go get him. Uh, it is kind of late. I apologize for that. But, uh, we can wait here. We are patient. All right, then. Okay. All right, all right. Let's wait here. She's gonna go get him. This one is very sorry to intrude that is our Mr. Archmage, but... Yeah, it's no problem. I've, um, met your associate. I hear you two need a translator. Yes. Do you know of one? I am one. Come with me, I imagine we'll not want to stand around freezing out here. I should apologize for my behavior when last we met. I didn't realize you were the Archmage. When we met, I wasn't. This is a... a recent development. I see. And... that person I warned you about? He's dead. And, um, you can stop looking for my dossier now. Oh. You two know each other? Kanan has been a thorn in my side since I got to Skyrim. I still wonder what it is he wants with me. Greetings, Archmage. He's standing right here and would be happy to talk about it out of the prying ears of young magicians. Point taken. situation recently. I've been studying the anomalies that slipped through the cracks. Thankfully, my enchanting background... It, never mind, it's a long story. He... it's kind of cute. Does it have a name? Not yet. I hadn't considered naming it, actually. How about Moat? Moat? As a name. I don't know, it's just a thought. Ah, That's a cute name. This one did not know you had it in you. Oh, all right. If we're done ogling the arcane... Oh, right. Sorry. Uh, this one has a journal that she needs help with. Uh, we don't really know what language it's in. It isn't alt Maris or Vaz Maris either. I'd have been able to read it if that were the case. <laughs> well, I might be one of about three people in Skyrim that could help with that. I think a librarian could too, but he's a little busy right at the moment. Oh? Let's just say I feel personally responsible for what happened in Winterhold, and I'm trying my best to make amends. Now about that journal. Whoa. Your eyes are all glowy. Yep. It's an enchantment. It's actually soul gem dust imbued with meteoric... Uh, well, put simply, it helps me pull out the patterns inherent to script and language and makes processing them easier. It's a complex spell, one I wrote myself and would be hard-pressed to duplicate even with my notes. Now I see why you were on a watch list. Yep. That's exactly what they wanted me for. <clears throat> um, sorry, I... I need to focus. My apologies. No, oh, damn it, this is Falmeris. It's not similar enough to anything I can already read for me to make out much, but... I'm catching a few words here and there. Take your time. This one is patient. Ha. What? Just let the man work, Z. Um, this seems like something I shouldn't be looking at. May I ask who sent you, miss? Um... Shady people. Not the Thalmor. Don't worry about that. Alright. Well, I am um, soon to be having a bit of trouble with my eyes this evening. I can send you to one of my colleagues, one who deals in shady business, and I'll send you with a translation key. I feel like the less I know about whatever's going on here, the better off we'll all be. 
That would be most useful, Mr. Archmage. And as for you, I suspect you're not just here as an escort. Correct. We'll talk when you're done. Alright. Well, miss, I can point you to Enther. He may or may not have mentioned someone named Gallus before, and I may or may not have overheard, but perhaps this will save you both some time. Thank you, Mr. Archmage. Are you going to come with me, Cayman? No, but we'll be in touch. I promise.